Hello guys, this is Indian Medico and in this video, we are going to discuss about ultrasound biomicroscopy. Ultrasound biomicroscopy is abbreviated as UBM. It is a type of ultrasound eye exam that creates more detailed image than regular ultrasound. It is a technique primarily used for imaging of anterior segment. This picture shows anterior segment imaging using ultrasound biomicroscopy. In ultrasound biomicroscopy, we use higher frequency transducer with a frequency of 35 to 50 megahertz which allows generation of images with much higher resolution. The resolution is typically 30 microns axial and 60 microns transverse. It has less depth penetration because of the higher resolution. Coming to the method of ultrasound biomicroscopy, topical anesthetic is applied. As you can see in this picture, the eyelids are open with an immersion bath. Usually we use water or methyl cellulose as coupling agent. High frequency scans are taken radial and parallel to the limbus at various predetermined positions. Coming to the indications of ultrasound biomicroscopy, it can be used in corneal biometry. It can be used in glaucoma patients to visualize pupil block, plateau iris, malignant glaucoma and pigment dispersion. This picture shows ultrasound biomicroscopy of a case of phacomorphic glaucoma. It can be used in the evaluation of unexplained hypotony due to cyclitic membranes and cyclodialysis clefts. It can be used in imaging anterior segment tumors like primary and secondary cysts, iris and ciliary body melanomas. This picture shows ultrasound biomicroscopy of a case of ciliary body melanoma. It can be used in the assessment of crystalline lens or implant position in case of phacic and piggyback implants. It can be used in the assessment of anterior segment in cases of corneal opacification like Peters anomaly and sclerocornea. If you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comment section. For more such videos, please check out my playlists. Thank you.